Welcome to the Jaron Jarvis channel. I am Jaron Jarvis. Today, I would like to introduce to you, the dark is following me. I woke up to the sound of an amber alert at around 9 a.m. Instead of the normal missing child report it read all New Yorkers stay alert and be aware that there is a major blackout but, go about you day normally. No lights will be on. It did not say why or when and, I thought it was odd that I got the alert because I don't live in New York. I live in New Jersey and I like 5 minute toss away from the bridge but, I was very close. I texted my friends and, asked them if they got the alert. All but one said no. The one that said yes said that he got the same alert and said that he also thought it was very odd, especially because he lives in Pennsylvania. That's four hours away, neither of us understood why he got it but, there was no major concern. All it said was that there would be no lights but we could go about our normal day. It's only one day. I looked out from my apartment, which has a clear view of most of New York and saw no car lights, no bridge lights, and no building lights. Where I live was completely fine and all lights still worked. So I was still confused why I got the alert. If anyone is not familiar with the New York area it's a very busy city and there are always lights on, no matter what time of the day or night. It looked as if you were looking at it at night but no lights. This shook me. This is what it looked like, not all the lights were off yet but you can see how dark this is. I took this from my apartment room. Sorry can't insert the pic. Intensely, this was at 9am I was scared I was shook I didn't know what to think. This was on summer break and I was about to go into high school and the only reason I remembered this was because I'm now dating that friend, the one who also got the alert and he brought it up in a conversation saying that his ex just texted him and said my city is in complete darkness and I got this weird alert on my phone saying alert there are no lights in Santa Monica you may go about your normal day but be aware of them. But this time it was in California and 10 years later from the first time it happened in New York. We are both currently 24 and almost had completely forgotten about the blackout in New York until this. New update. We are now currently married and in the span of 12 years we moved 4 times, each time our town experienced something similar to what happened when I was 14 and 24. Each town we moved to blacked out for 24 hours. I feel like the darkness is following me. Each alert over the years are getting worse they keep saying stay inside and don't use any bright flashlights and stay away from windows. I don't know what to do. I'm in my bathroom with no lights and shades drawn. I'm scared for my life, my husband's life and for my kid's life. If anyone find this please let everyone know what happened on 2018 the first day it happened and all the other times. I think the darkness is going to kill me.